would like to welcome you here in UAE, in Abu Dhabi in particular, and thank you for taking the time to participate in this very important event. events where those kind of people really meet and have a basis for discussion, uh, that will bring us further and, and uh, we are able to assess the risk for the future and we can inspire each other and, and stay enthusiastic. <laughs> The Global Space Conference gives us an opportunity to hear from other nations, from other parties, to understand their interest in space and how we can work together. Um, we can share what we're doing, make sure we're not overlapping, and see how we can work more closely together going forward. It's important to note that we need to collaborate for the space operating environment, so space is a global commons and while we're seeing increased activity in space, some fantastic innovation um, in satellites in particular, that collaboration is essential to make sure that we can safeguard the operating environment. The United Kingdom and the United Arab Emirates Space Agency have, have come together in a really ambitious three-year program of skills development, not only for the space sector, but for the wider science and engineering sectors. I think this is absolutely important that we, from the early stages when uh, pupils and students getting used to this uh, engineering, uh, mathematics, um, uh, electronics get used to this type of uh, disciplines and that they grow in the, in the sense of contributing and understanding that, it, that it, the, these are exciting jobs and that not only you're working in the offices but you are, you are building a, a, a mass mission. It's been a great opportunity to network and learn from others and the topics that we've discussed throughout the two days were very interesting and will help us shape our decision making in the future and our policy.